South African chef Nancy, who is based in Finland, complains about trolls from Zambia. Well, our Zambian people, some of you see how you are embarrassing yourselves. The same way you do things on these social media platforms, it has taken you now to a South African. Look at how she has exposed at the commentary and she has said exactly what many people have said about Zambia. Listen to this. I hope you guys are doing fine and you guys are doing well. I've been sitting here watching all the videos, I mean, the comments from Zambians. It's very uh, amazing and it amazes me that when I travel around the world and I, when I talk about my experiences in German, my experiences in Italy, which were not comfortable as a black person, when I go to Zambia, you Zambians have a lot to say. You are writing text messages and after text messages, the videos that I expect you as well to respond on, your, mes your, 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 your messages are very short. Hmm? Who told you that when we went to Zambia, we were broke? Because you are writing, Uguti, we were traveling on the budget, and you were on the wrong side of the city. You, so what are you saying about the people who are living in Livingstone? So the people who are living in Livingstone, where we went to, are living in the wrong side of the town. So those people are wrong. What are you, what, what, what are you actually emphasizing on that? Zambians, you come here. Slow connection for what? Slow connection for what? Zambia and Z, you come, you come, I want to see you, and I want those long text messages you were writing on the other videos to write it now. So now, I want to ask you this. When I was pushing the wheelbarrow with the banana, why didn't you say I was on the wrong side of the city? When I went to the town and I was giving free tomatoes, free, you know, or spinach, you guys were not having this big, you were not having these long text messages. Uh, no, um, yeah, you are representing Zambia. Who paid me to go to Zambia and represent Zambia? Because me and I went to Zambia to travel as a tourist. It was a surprise from my mother. Hmm? And you know what? Let me tell you, most of your messages that you are writing, these long text messages, most of them, it shows that it was written by people who have never even set their foot outside of Zambia. Because if you are a travel, you will understand. You understand me? You will understand. There is a guy who came and said, slow connection for Masimba and this slow connection. There is a guy who said to me, ah, oh, remember you are in Zambia. You can't talk about sexual stuff and this and that. Like, honey, like, why are you teaching me how I should behave in a country? How can you teach me Uzi, how I should behave when I have been traveling and stop watching only the adult content and watch all my content? Because, honey, I am a professional European chef. You understand me? I'm a content creator. I'm a businesswoman. So don't cut or caress me. Don't go and fix my English. That's what you are best on, on fixing things. You understand? Go and fix it. Don't have to casualize me in one, in, in one small sentence. I'm very, very smart. I wasn't going to go to Zambia on my holiday. You understand? There I was surprised by a parent and go there and sit and teach. And I don't remember. I only remember in Botswana, they had to ask me to talk about it. I went to Botswana to promote my product to see Botswana. You understand me? Not to go there and teach about the bedroom. But they ask to involve it. So now, when you think you are so smart after watching my content, and I want to tell you this, y'all are writing all these comments, I'm already in Europe. Do you see where I am? I was already like on my way to Europe. It's a content that I've already done. Most of the comments that I didn't even uh, uh, answer on, saying that, oh, they didn't have money, they went on a side, a, a wrong side of the city and everything. Let me tell you because you don't travel. Let me tell you because you don't travel. When you travel, you don't only go to one place. When you go, you have a week of traveling, go to different hotels and different places and never measure anyone with a hotel if they had money or not. There's people who are backpackers. When they travel, they will sleep in hostels. They will sleep, uh, they will camp outside. It does not mean that they didn't have money. It means it's the experience that they wanted was the experience of not sleeping in expensive hotels but because you have never traveled you will write a long text message and say oh they were traveling on a budget see they didn't have money it just it shows it just shows your mentality your intelligence it shows what you have never set a foot outside of zambia for you to say that to measure us with the hotel now let's go back on four thousand the lodge was four thousand rand and but let me let, let me first give you the 
history. But well, fucking let me let me first give you the history. That hot that lodge is owned by a black woman. She's an artist in Zambia. We even bought to support that black woman as black South Africans before we even go to Radisson Blue. Right now, I will ask you, Zambians, stand up and tell me who owns Radisson Blue. Stand up and tell me right now who owns Radisson Blue. Who owns a van? The one that you were telling us we should have booked there and not book on the wrong side of the city. Meaning that people who are living in Livingstone are wrong people because it is the wrong side of the city. And I want to tell you, Zambian, that you the internet, anyway in Zambia, it will show you the best side of the Zambia. But enter Zambia is what I was showing you. And it was less. It was 10% of what you see on the internet and what you are experienced when you are in Zambia. And you're not going to sit here and tell me I'm representing, uh, I'm misrepresenting Zambia. I am telling you about the experience and what I saw. As much as I don't lie about Europe, when I travel Europe, I'm not going to go to Zambia just because it's Africa and tell you otherwise. I tell you the good and the bad. And if you are sensitive, you can't take it. Please go to South Africa and tell me you won't be shocked. Because I was shocked because I'm a South African and I'm a European. And swallow that I am a European. I've been here for 12 years. I have a permanent resident. So, of course, I come from developed very well developed countries obviously when i went to zambia i was surprised because it's not as well as developed as, as the countries have been in so you guys are sensitive sensitive for who for what sensitive i made the last video there was a sense of humor with my mother that we said because we travel an hour crossing zambia border to zimbabwe so we made a joke because we've been traveling for hours we saw crocodiles and lion are chasing us don't tell me to come down you live my life i'm not your child I cannot behave like how you behave. I cannot talk like how you talk. I talk with emotions. I don't even own or owe you to explain about myself. If you feel like I'm up and you can't take me down because obviously I cannot come down, I'm up. Live my life. Is you understanding me? Nami, I wish I could say the same to you on your comment section and say, come down, Zambian. Stop being sensitive. Now, let's go back to the hotel, to the 4,000. Did you see the side of Zamba where I was in the supermarket where I was giving for free? Which you Zambians, you, you didn't quote that. I gave Zambians for free. Tomatoes. I was calling everyone who was passing by. Come take tomatoes. You understand me? Come and take this. So much people. I was supporting a woman that was selling. She, she, she actually gave me this. Before I even went there. So I was like, this lady is sweet. She gave me this for free. You understand? And she was wearing it. It was dirty, but she gave me to, 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 to cover more. So when I was giving, why I didn't see long text messages? When, when, when I was giving the tomatoes, you didn't write the long text messages because you are watching the content to respond, not to learn. Hmm? Not to learn. If you're telling me to come down, I'm blocking you. Because you need to live the life. So again, the, 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 it was three quarter for tomatoes. In South Africa, you will not find one rand or one rand 20 cent tomatoes, for tomatoes. It means Ugu the country. The country is a bit struggling. You understand me? It's not the same as South Africa. And don't tell me not to compare because I am a South African. What you want me? You want me to compare Zambia and Zimbabwe? I'm not a Zimbabwean. So I'm not about to compare those countries. You understand me? So when I was giving, the, if the tomatoes is three quarter, four tomatoes, 4,000 rand is a lot of money for some of you to say we didn't have a budget with my mother. For some, and it's not about the money. It's just me wanting to tell you guys, to open your brains. When people travel, they choose where they want to. It's not because of the budget or the money. Now, here's the thing. In Zambia, there's people whose salaries are, are, are lower than 4,000 rand a month. So as a Zambian, you can't say 4,000 was a small money. You, you, you just cannot. Mm, not. You understand me? Not. And there is a lot that I, I, I try to be very positive about what I experienced and saw in Zambia. And it 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 warms me up. It makes me sweat when I post and posted the way I posted. And there's people who are sensitive. If you Zambians, you want a content that is gonna be very lavish and is gonna be representing. They go to my mother's uh, 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 Facebook. She's uh, she's feel at home. My mother sugarcoats everything on that video. She posted the video so perfectly from the hotel to the to the shuttle to the to the train to she didn't show that what I was showing. If you want that there is someone who presented your country perfectly, 
go watch my mother's content. You see on my content, I will show everything and I will tell you everything. Now, let's go back to the wrong side of the town. The, the lodge we were sleeping in is called uh, Zingomazi. Now, I will promote that woman. It's called Zim Zingomazi, if I'm not mistaken. That 4,000 uh, hotel that you say it was cheap is owned by a black woman that is a, 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 is a, is a artist in Zambia. The blue, blue the, the, the right is on blue, you guys were counting. I don't know what white person owns that place. You understand? So, sometimes you guys need to open this and close this. Is you understanding me? You should, you close this, especially when you have never set foot outside of your country. It's better to do this. Mm. Mm. Is you understanding me? Mm. Mm -mm. When we travel and go to countries, so see, we got there to experience the whole town. There is no wrong sight and the beautiful sight. As you guys, when you most of the post and even that hotel was showing the best sight. It did not show the city or the town and that there was outside, there was dust. So then now, Zambians, I want you, especially when you have never set foot in your country, to close your mouth when we are posting, when we travel. They, and also remember, do not judge people with where they are sleeping, with how much they have. The way I'm so sweating. I am busy here also boiling my steam as to steam my, 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 my cook. Is you understanding me? If I can show you my legs right now, how much I'm sweating. I've been sweating reading these comments and I'm thinking, these people need me to, to come back and talk to them before they can open their mouth as they are opening their mouth. Telling us that it was the site, it was the wrong site. I must go to Lusak. Let me tell you, for me, a problem is time. I can wake up and go to Lusaka. And the way you are telling me about Lusaka, I expect Europe. I expect Europe. I expect something. Because no, you should have went to Lusaka. You went to the wrong side of the city. You should have went to Lusaka. Lusaka, Lusaka. Is Lusaka Europe? Huh? Is Lusaka Europe? Or the issue is that you are choosing what should be shown on the internet about your country. And now is it the issue when we are showing everything that we experience when I am showing everything I experience? Mina, it's a matter of booking a flight and go to Lusak. So ni yang sabi simnege Lusak. Don't sabi sami putting Lusaka in my face. You should have went to Lusaka. You should have went to Lusaka. You should have went to Lusaka. Mina, I came back and let me tell you because you guys don't really think much. There is a lot of white people, a lot of Europeans and Americans who want to experience the dust of Africa. So my content, since I am international, I showed everything what most Europeans and Americans would want to go and see. But when you guys are telling them, no, it's the wrong side of the city, it's the wrong side, what are you telling the, the Europeans? You, you represented our country wrongly. Uh, did you pay me to go to Zimbabwe, to, to, to Zambia? Did you contribute on my mother's surprise paying for that trip when you are telling me I should have a, had a way of presenting your country? Mina, I showed everything I could show. And let me tell you, every place have its own people. There is a lot of people who are going to watch my content, even on Instagram, who's going to visit Lusaka because of me. Yeah, 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 who's going to visit Livingstone because of me. You understand? You guys are not counting as well. Ugusu. We went there with our South African rents and paid money in the wrong side of the city. You are not looking at that. You are looking at what is going to make you comfortable. Because you've never set your foot outside of Zambia. Hey, Nina, you're not going to come here and be sensitive on me. Because this Lusaka, this Lusaka, I will take you to Lusaka. You will be shocked what you will find. It's not going to be like Europe. Okay. I'll give you food. And right now I'm not in the mood, so you need to shift. Shift. Even now I'm a, I'm a, I'm a Zambian. I am picking me I'm coming down to those who are saying, hey, 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 hey. And also, guys, since we are here, since you are here, hmm, I have sat here and talked to South Africans about wearing a bonnet in, in the garage, about wearing... Do you know how many Zimbabweans in the taxi rank in the city who are in, in the streets and wearing a bonnet? Do you know? A bonnet is the one that we use for sleeping when you cover your hair. Do you know how many people? And you can see... And I saw myself to those people because me now I don't care about making my hair when I come on social media. I'm too busy. Those people, they look like they were sleeping with those bonnets and they look like they woke up immediately and went to the city. Do you understand me? 
So if I did show those people, you were going to say what? Ah, eh, you should have shown me. Eh, we have the stores. We have this. We have that. I did not vitorize those people. And there was a lot of them. There was a lot. I didn't show them. You know why? Because I saw myself in them. When you, are, when you are hustling, you are doing business. No, we have a full chicken. Uncle, chicken. There is a chicken, a full chicken. No, no. Yo. Yo. Uzobili, yo yenza la. You gonna do it, stay eat it. Kuliko, mina, amina, altan, so. Do you as long as you are happy. And where's daughter? I am happy. I am happy. First, let us do my tea. I am very happy, sis. I am so happy that uh, everything I was experiencing in Africa and just now I'm back in Europe. And I'm now uh, cleansing and cleaning myself. Now, you change the, the vid. What is happening right now? So I will show you guys like this. This is my steamer. It's 80 rand to South African. It's for steaming your cook. So after being in Africa for a while. Now I will put guys, I don't know because I don't know why. I'm gonna wait 10 minutes before I sit. Mangoba tule, tule, come, come, come. Before I go and sit there, here is my steamer. It's 80 rand. It's for steaming your cook. You're steaming. And Zambian, I'm not finished. There is a lot I still want to give you with. There is a lot. Someone said, that's not good. Someone said, I shouldn't compare South Africa and Zambia. And I thought it was okay. I should call. I wasn't comparing. But obviously, I was. And now, to show and see, Uguti, you guys, you think you are smart. But you are smart. You are very smart. But you are smart where you want to be smart. Now, here is the thing. Let's also talk about... It's not only... Uh, wait, man. Hey, Ole, come. Let's also... And guys, I need to be vigilant that my son is cooking. Let's also talk about the race thing. I say your comment as Zambians. Uguti, this experience of pushing the white people in the front and have people who are putting in the back is not just... That was doing the it's what you guys were writing showing Uguti. You don't you don't think most of you guys are broad. You don't think far. You 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 thinking otherwise. I can't spend the same money as a European, but the treatment is different. I even had couples from America, black couples, because they were not asked if they are from America. So they were also seated at the back. You understand me? I had other also couples, two couples also, who said they were sitting in a restaurant next to the flies. They even went back. It was at the border of Zim and, and Zambia. Why there is a different treatment? I saw you. I showed you. Yeah. Hey, Darvi, tama on balion oil. And and guys, I want to ask you. Did you you saw it in the train? We were seated at the back next to the toilets. You understand me? Because we were positive, the positive that you guys don't see. Do you know how much it was in the train? It was 5,000 rand per person. $220. Go and Google it. $220 per person. Some of you have never even went in the train, but you are sitting here. No, you shouldn't have been talking like that. Since when you are supporting your country, why you haven't been in the train? Since it's very cheap in Zambia, why you haven't been in the train? Since you have a big mouth, why you haven't been in the train? Why you haven't been in that train? Because you can type, 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 and the prices won't be the same for tourists and the local. You won't, you will not know because you don't go to these places where you can open your mouth very, very big. You don't go to those places. You do not go to those places. That train, that dinner for five hours was 5,000 rand South African. Some of you, it's your salary. It is your salary. But you are coming here. They were traveling on budgets. They were traveling on budgets. That's why they went on the wrong side of the seat. Ha! Ha! <laughs> My mother spent that money there, honey. Money! I'm asking about the train. Have you been in? No, you did not want to talk about the train. Instead, you want to concentrate on you. want to concentrate on... Menage, I'm telling, as you guys say, Lusaka, Lusaka, I'm gonna go to Lusaka. 
And if I don't find Europe in Lusak, I don't find something like South Africa, I'll come back and show you. Woman, you are acting like Lusaka is the best of the best. On the internet, it says Livingstone is the best in Zambia. They say it's the best in Zambia. So I don't know what you guys are you sensitive about. I don't know what you guys are sensitive about. Let's move on. Since now we are traveling on budget, I want to tell you because some of you guys don't really think. So 5,000 per person. We were two people. That's 10,000, right? Let's go to Radisson Blue. We were facing where no, it was not Lusaka. It was it was now we are concentrating on the fact that I called a, a living stone Lusaka. No 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 it's not it's not no you are not telling us we are traveling on budget. You are not telling us we are traveling. We are in Radisson Blue now. Radisson Blue now where is your long comment that we, we were traveling on budget? Where is the long comment? You know, your long comments are no more there. Now you are trying to find other mistakes. Whoever is writing, I must come down. You must live my life. You must unfollow this page. Don't tell me to come down. When you are writing nonsense on the comment section, I did not say to you, you must come down. I let you guys write all those long messages. We talk about supporting black businesses, black businesses. When we went to Zambia to support long black businesses, no, you were at the wrong side of the country. Long, wrong side of the country. And we supported. We su Let me show you. I want to show. Wait, 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 wait. I want to go and show you. Ala laita ena. E muta e. Not too late, too late. Hey, mode. Guys, I want to show you. It's just that I left most of the things in Zambia. I mean, in South Africa. I need my son to move away from the store. Wait, guys. Before I show you, wait. I want to help my son. And you can't tell people who they must go to your country and not be surprised. You are shocked and surprised, Vela, when you are not used to something. And I cannot lower my standard. Lower my standard of understanding that there were seven hours of no electricity in a 4,000 hotel. That is someone's salary. No. Eh, you can't compare. You can't compare. Then you can't. I have. Hey, Nina. Yay, Nina. Yay, Nina. I wish you could everyone who was commenting would come to South Africa before you come and say that. Because now you'll be shocked what you will find in South Africa for 4,000 rent. Shock of your life. Selling it it's cheap. Mina, I'm not the one. You go to my mother. My mother's Facebook page is Feel at Home. Say Feel at Home. You will find what you are looking for. You will find this lavish content. You will find on my mother the sugar coating. You will find the beauty of Zambia. To me, you will not find all of the Zambia. My mother sugar coated all the content. Not she didn't she didn't sugar coat, but she posted the lavish of Zambia. Never said anything. That was what was was something to be said as well. She said all the nice and positive stuff. And she did tell me, no, don't say everything. Because you don't say anything about people's country. But now how would you learn? Another thing I'm saying is that what I show it have its own certain people. There is a lot of Europeans that follows me and Americans that will go to Zambia because of my videos. To the wrong side of the city. Which is actually shocking. How can a wrong side of the city be this be the site of the tourist attraction where the Victoria Falls is? You are calling it a wrong site. You are telling people that they should only be going to Lusak. So they mustn't go to Victoria Falls because it's the wrong side of the city. The people who are living in Livingstone are wrong people because it's the wrong side of the city. What are you actually saying, Zambians? Tell me. Tell me, Zambians, what are you saying? If you're calling a uh, living on the wrong side of the seat, lodge, why did you go to that lodge? You are telling everyone who's gonna watch my content not to go to the lodges. And the lodges are owned by black people. What are you what are you what are you talking about, Zambians? What are you saying? Is Livingstone the wrong side of the seat? Is it? We didn't know with my mother. If we knew we were gonna go to Lusaka, we just thought we were gonna go and support. And then there is one Deshaton. You Deshaton who said no, I was lying that the, the, the meter tax was $20. Wait, honey. Actually, it was more than $20. You will not know that the locals, 
and the tourists are not charged the same price. So you can't come here and tell me, no, it was not the, the, the $20. She's misrepresenting the country. When I, when I tell her, Tony, what the she? Yeah? Okay, finish. That's the. I'm not correct here. Hmm? Nizo Tingan, come here. Are you going to say I'm showing off? But Tige, let me first save my European child. Exact. Let me save my European child before I continue. If you have jealousy and problem with that, swallow it. Yes, I am in Europe. I am a European. Swallow it. The sensitivity you have, you you are very fast when I'm talking about Europe to come and comment. Very very fast. Now I came to your country. Let I save my European child first. If you have an issue, swallow it. Let I save. I just came back from my African child. Now I'm with a European child. Wait. Because I want to. I'm going to. Yo, Mina, on behind me. Mix. In a young boozala, my European child is asking me what is the problem. I'm even scared to tell him because he's going to start not having a respect for Africans. If I can tell him things that you guys were saying on the comment section, my son will not understand. Uguti, mommy, what kind of a person can say, Uguti, you didn't have money, you were on the wrong side of the city when you went to support the camp? He's not gonna, he's seven years old, but I'm sure he's gonna be shocked. A seven year old is gonna be shocked. Uguti, there is a mother in Africa who said that. There is a father in, in, in Africa who said, don't talk about sexual content when you are there. But when you go and watch the, the profile, this person can have never even been in the border of Zimbabwe. Just the border. But he's telling me how I should... See, he even said, because countries are different. You are telling me countries are different when I've been in 39 countries. 39 countries! You will tell me countries are different. You haven't even been in Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe, two minutes to go to Zimbabwe. From Zambia, you haven't even been there. But you are telling me you have a, a, a Zota Wabantu was bent because. Don't push it me, Nina. Don't push it me, Nina. Mina, I'm not the one. Mina, I'm not the one. Mina will come here and come for you. Root. Root. Because the issue here is not the money. Mina, I don't need to prove to anyone. If I have money or I don't have money. And I want to go to next time. When I book a hostel somewhere, you sit there and close your mouth. If I want to be in the hostel, I want to be in the hostel. You, like the suppose. If I want to be in the hostel, I want to be in the hostel. I can, I should not be judged by you. Hey, hey it was the budget. It was the budget. Zota Wabantu was bent. You also we will be bent. Did you go to school now? Nah? Did you go to school? Because your comments sound like you didn't even go to school. You only learned how to write. <coughs> Mina will show you flimsy. Mina will continue with my sexual content and I'll still come to Lusak. You understand? And also, stop having this mentality that when a person is known, popular, famous, celebrity, when you go to a country, you are going there to do work. We travel to go experience things. Just because I'm popular does not mean when I go to there, I need to say. And also, I didn't even need visa to come there. I don't even think you know. Then I just, my mother just said to me, here is a ticket. She said we are going on Friday. She did not tell me where we are going. And if I want to go to Lusaka, I don't even need to announce. I go to Lusaka and come back to from Lusaka. And then come back and show you. Because yeah, now I'm expecting Lusaka to be something else, to be the right side of the seat. That's what I'm expecting from Lusaka, right side of the seat. I'm not expecting people in Lusaka to have bonnets. I'm not expecting to see people who look like they slept and woke up and went to work. I'm not expecting, I'm expecting high heels. I'm expecting, in, in, in Livingstone, I only saw one person, one person who had a weave in her head. Everyone, it's either bonnets or they had their afro. Yeah, when I go to Lusaka, I'm expecting straight backs, long weaves. I'm expecting high heels. I'm expecting suits. Uh, because it is the right side of the city. 
I'm expecting people there to be something else because it's the right side of the city. I'm expecting bond shoes. I am expecting every road to, to not have a dust because it is the right side of the city. <clears throat> On the right side of the city, everyone should be going kwa, 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 kwa. Everyone should smell perfume. Everyone should smell perfume. Because where I was, I did not smell perfume. I, in Lusaka, you, you calling that the wrong side? In Lusaka, I let you guys smell the 3,000 perfume. As on the other side, I did not even smell a roll-on. So then you guys, some of you are talking about South Africa, have Xenophobia, at least in our country. Yeah, yeah, nah. Don't touch me. Let this Lusaka you are putting in my face be something else. Because you're calling Livingstone, where the tourists are coming to support your own economy, you are calling it the wrong side. Let the Lusaka be something else. Since my son is done, and I also want to, to, to steam my cook, I want to show you this. You come here, you dash it on. You come here. Gang is on a lot of dash it on. What's that? What's that? What's that? You come here. You come here. Talking about the wrong side. When we go to support the country, telling, telling me that we were in the wrong side of the country. Telling me about the wrong side of the country. High holy. Let you know that it's something else. If it's not, so Kaban, we will be Kaban and Ring. You come here. You come here. I went to the man who was at the wrong side of the city. Where I was calling tomatoes and everything to go and do this. Supporting a man. My mother made a dress. My mother made a dress. Let me show you. Let me put it on for you. To the wrong side of the city. As you were misrepresenting. I want to leave money where now that you wouldn't even live in one month. The money we spend it in, in, in Zambia, you were now, you were writing a comment, re, misrepresenting, misrepresenting, only thing you do is talk. You don't put your money where your mouth is. Blah, 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 blah. What's that? Hey, Nenabo Teshaton, come here. You see? Don't be my friend. Huh? Now the problem is I don't know how to turn my camera around. Oh my god. It doesn't show that icon of turning the camera. Oh now I see it. I want to show you this. This man. The money that he charged me for this I paid him two times. Double because it was too cheap. Stunning outfit. You're going to see it because I was wearing it in Johannesburg. Two pieces. Look at this. When I, oh, you were at the wrong side of the city. This was someone's father. This was an old man. This man was someone's father. Uh, hustling for his family. I gave him double of what he charged me for this outfit. We left it with my mother on Friday. We went to fetch it on Monday. You understand me? You see this side from that? This material, I bought it from a guy on the wrong side of the city. 